it's me, Cynthia. I am she. And why is everything so loud? I can't figure out why it's so loud in here. It, I don't, it, it sounds like my doors are not closed all the way. I think they are. It's just very loud in here. I have the air off. No, I don't have the air off. The air is off. It made no difference in the sound. I went on YouTube because that's where I live. I was looking for audiobooks that I, I listen to. Wow. And I found Stephen King's new book called The Outsider. But it's on YouTube for free right now. Two videos. It's t so far, it's like 28 hours. I'm on video two. The first video was over 11 hours. And the second video is over eight hours, like eight hours, eight, you know, almost nine. And it is awesome. And I don't get scared anymore. Well, I, I do get scared, but in like real life ghosts, like books haven't scared me in a very long time. And by a very long time, I mean like a year or two. Well, anyway, so Mark was out of town. He was visiting family in Wisconsin. And I was listening to Outsider. And I got scared. I got scared and uh, it was a scary feeling not to mention okay <laughs> this is really weird me and the dogs the dogs and I were in the spare bedroom I was going through a box of pictures and we were sitting in complete silence because the dogs can't talk I didn't have anybody to talk to I was just looking at pictures and I hear knocking three knocks I look at the dogs <laughs> to see if they're like leaned up against anything. They're not. The dogs look at me. The dogs look at each other. And then they started barking like maniacs. So I froze. I didn't know what to do. I don't have any... Why is everybody going 45 miles per hour? I don't have any weapons. I think I already vlogged this. I probably didn't post it. Anyway, so I don't have any weapons. I, after I froze, I unfroze. I go out into the living room and I grab the gun. I had to go check. I had a gun and I don't remember what I had in my other hand. Something to swing with. I don't know. And I had the dogs. So we went and did room by room inspections, cleared the house, house is cleared, I'm not going outside, I'm not clearing the front yard, I'm not clearing the backyard, I'm staying inside with my dogs and my gun. Alright. As I'm clearing the room that the knocking was in, the window, the, now the, the window is in the front yard, Mark calls and he FaceTimes. So. I opened the FaceTime, but I opened it with the ceiling up, because I didn't want him to see me. And he goes, what are you doing? And I said, oh, nothing. And he goes, I, I'm looking at the ceiling. What's wrong with the, what's wrong with your phone? And I said, nothing. And he goes, let me see your face. And I said, no. And he goes, why do you sound weird? And I said, I'm not. <laughs> and he goes, look at me. So I, I did the, that with the phone. And he goes, why do you look scared? And I said, I'm not. And he goes, why do you have a gun? And I said, because somebody knocked on the window. And he said, what? Call the police. And I said, you don't just call the police because someone knocked on the window. It could be a little kid. And I said, nobody knows I'm home alone. I'm not calling the police. It's probably just a... I forgot what I was saying. Anyway, as I was saying, I don't remember what I was saying. So, oh yeah, so I have the gun. He's like, why do you have the gun? Ah, close, please. Ah. And I was like, I checked the house. Everything's cool. I have the gun, have the dogs. I'm cool. Then I'm listening to this book and I got terrified out of my mind and I could not sleep for two nights. Two nights. I could not sleep. 
a potential murderer in my yard was not as scary as the book. <laughs> and that makes me question everything in my life. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, that's that. And uh, now the hockey's over, even though I just found it at the end of April. Um, I, I feel this giant void in my life. And, uh, I feel very sad. I'm still following all of the team on Instagram. And they're getting married and having baby checkups and doing all this stuff. So, I get to stay in their lives like a weirdo stalker than I am. Um, as far as my channels are going, they're not going anywhere. I do this thing where I upload and release a bunch of videos and then I go ahead and stop um, doing all of that. I totally stop recording, editing, and uploading. So, you probably just watched a week full of stuff and now I have nothing. And I'm recording a bunch of stuff now, but I'll never, you won't see this for another six months. <laughs> uh, I'm in this phase, it's going on a year now, that I hate editing. I hate it. So, I don't know what to do. I don't know. You two just really, really refused to move while I made the bed. You two are cheeky Charlies. Cheeky.